This movie demonstrates use of the split part tools for the new edit splits option. If we go to the help files and click on the help topics, the first one in the list is split part tools. The edit splits option allows you to split a part into multiple pieces. Visually it will still appear to be one piece. However, in your cut list and CNC outputs, you will get separate parts for each split. Let's take a look. For this example, I've placed a long base cabinet on a wall. I'm going to take this into the editor. As you can see on the cut list, I have one unfinished bag that is 99 and a quarter inches long. I know I will need this split into two parts for production purposes. If I go to the face orthographic view, and then going to select the unfinished back and now right click and select the new edit splits option. If you notice at the top list, top left, this opens up the features available. We can split a part horizontally or vertically or we can delete the split or we can delete all the splits. For this example I'm going to split uh, vertically one time. I click on the split vertically and if you'll notice at the top left, the X or the zero position from left to right for the part appears. I'm going to click my tab button, type in 30, and hit the enter key. You'll notice by the red line on the part that this part is now split into two pieces. If we go to the 3D view to have a look, you'll notice that as we described, it still appears as one part. However, if you go to the cut list, you now have two pieces, one 30 inches as we wanted, and the leftover 69 and a quarter, which is what you need for your production. This concludes the demonstration of the edit splits option. For more information on how Cabinet Vision can help you become more efficient and profitable, please visit www.cabinetvision.com. Thank you for watching.